And now, live in high definition. From the fifth largest city in America and broadcasting worldwide on DaveFratLive.com. From beautiful downtown Phoenix, your morning mayor, Dave Pratt. Oh, yeah. You know, on Dave Pratt Live, we always try to bring you things that are interesting and unique. And, oh, we have one today. In fact, he's my buddy and an awesome creative jeweler with a unique offering, Joe Mangione. How you doing, Joe? Great. How are you doing, Dave? Good. Kind of like Chuck Mangione, is that right? Exactly. Any relation? He's second cousin. Oh, seriously? I was just joking around. He really is? Yes. All right. So it, the way that I described you, is that fair? Because we're, we're buddies, and I don't really know what your title is, but I know you're a creative jeweler. I, am I in the pocket there? Exactly. I'm a master jeweler. Okay, master jeweler. Yes. All right, which is a step up from creative jeweler. It's in the same category. Okay. All I know is that you're really good at what you do, and you have a unique item here. Tell us about Dice on Ice. Well, it's a unique item. A uh, ring that I developed, it's actually dice inside of a showcase on top of a ring. Oh, you brought the ring. Let me see it, man. Yes. All right. Okay, so it's dice. Go ahead, Joe. It's dice. It's actually, in, oh, okay. I got it. You can actually, you can I, roll I can roll them. dice. I got yeah. a lucky seven. Yeah, baby. Wow, again. <laughs> okay, so why dice on ice? What What made you think of this? Um, um, I grew up in Las Vegas, and I got this idea from craps tables that it would be a great idea to have a ring that you could actually bet, you could play with your friends with it, stuff like that. Are, are you a gambler yourself? Yes. So being, being from Vegas, I yes. imagine so, right? Yes, I, so if I go to Vegas and I'm Mr. Big Time and I put dice on ice on my finger there and I go to roll some craps... You could actually bet with your friends to I'm see who's like, going to get sevens. I'm looking like big time. I always have a pair of dice with me. Yes. That's nice, man. You could play on the go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when did you... So are you the only one that's ever done a ring like this? Yes, that's the first ever. And when did you come up with this idea? You mentioned you're from Vegas, but I've seen you quite a few times in Arizona. So yes. where did this idea first spark? Um, actually, in Vegas, I was playing craps, and I thought, well, I could play craps here but i'd like to play craps everywhere i go so i okay. made the ring developed it and it's about six seven years all right so I, i'm like i'm not a jeweler at all i just respect good work and i'm looking at it what are the dice made of that's actually stainless uh silver like stainless steel or silver well, oh, the, no, di the dice are silver those are both it's, it's all silver that okay was a, it was a prototype to get the copyright on it okay so the, you got the die, and then the what's that, like crystal kind of stuff at the bottom, the foundation it's actually, of it? It's uh, cubic zirconians, but mm -hmm. the actual model is diamonds with actual gold. So it's a gold version. And you got the copyright on this thing. Yes. It's about seven years in the copyright. How much does it go for? Well, the silver ring, I'm trying to I put it out there for like $65. Oh, that's much more reasonable than I expected. Well, and the stainless steel is 65, and the silver is going to be in the 200 range. Okay. Now, if, uh, you know, Sean Combs <laughs> wants a ring, or if Tom Brady orders up a ring, I'm sure that you could do this in platinum. and <laughs> Yes, platinum. <laughs> Plenty gold. of bling opportunities yes. is what I'm saying, Joe. Yes. I'm just saying the Super Bowl is coming to town. Right. You'll and have some players here, right? Exactly, yes. Not that NFL players ever like to gamble. I would not assume that. No, <laughs> of course not. But I would imagine that a few of them like to roll the old. This is cool, Joe. Yeah, it's a neat ring. All right, now let's get to the information that our listeners will want if they'd like to get one of these unique rings. And, and you guys, I got to say, this is a, it's a really unique gift. If you know a gambler or for your lady, I guarantee you it's something that they don't have. You're trying to come up with something unique. This is a unique gift. That's why Joe's on Dave Pratt Live. I just wanted to throw it by you. So how do our listeners get more information about this or possibly even buy one from you? You can go on DiceOnIce.com, and you could also see it on Indiegogo.com. So Indiegogo is a crowdfunding site. Right. That's a campaign that I'm running right now to get it manufactured and get it off the ground. Okay. So DiceOnIce.com. Yes, and that will take you to the website diceonice.com and you will see the Indiegogo logo if you want to fund the campaign 
that's possible you could do it there. Okay, so on the site, you have photos of the ring. You tell more about it. Do you have pricing, and they can buy the ring right there? Yes. The first 25 people to fund it on Indiegogo is, are going to get the ring for $25. Do you guarantee wins at the craps table? <laughs> yes, <laughs> of course. <laughs> you roll them. <laughs> For anybody who buys these rings, Joe will set you up with showgirls who we went to high school with in Las Vegas, and they will take care of you. Of course, they look like Betty White now, but hey, they're going to take care of you. Of no. course. <laughs> so what high school did you go to in Las Vegas? I went to Bonanza. I went to several of them. I asked because I'm from Nevada, Joe, yes. so I know all the schools there because yeah. they kicked our butt over and over and right. over. So Bonanza and Chaparral, and I, I know exactly. all of them yeah. in Vegas. Las Vegas High. Congratulations. Dice on Ice. Joe Mangione, give the website one more time. Diceonice.com is the website, and you will see the versions of the ring. There it is, Dice on Ice, Joe Mangione. Joe, thanks a lot. Appreciate it. Thank you, Dave. Thanks for having me. Congratulations. I like my ring. Keeping it. Get out of here, Joe. (laughs)